So what's going on guys, it's Fuzzy here. Welcome back to another graphic settings on civilization, whatever. Um, basically today we're just going to do a quick one, it's not going to be that long. Um, I've got a benchmark at the end of it to obviously pass at the 10 minutes, so you know. But uh, yeah, so we're going to get straight into it. As you can already see the settings on the screen, if you guys want to copy down and pause. And if you have any different gra graphic settings that you think are better than these, uh, then please feel free to put them down in the description, uh, sorry, not the description, the comments below, and I will pin your comment to say this is the best one. I've tried them out, whatever. Anyway, so we're going to get straight into it. So first you want to set your resolution to your resolution. Uh, you want to leave this off. You want to put it in full screen or borderless windows, depends. I've got three monitors, so I keep all my games in borderless windows. Um, so that I can obviously go to different windows and click and whatnot. I've got VSync off, depending on what computer you've got, you want VSync on. And also depending on what uh, screen you have. So if you've got a 240 hertz or 144 hertz or 60 hertz. 60 hertz, I recommend having VSync on. Same with 144 hertz. Anything higher, I've got a 240 hertz. I just feels like it, it feel, feels like it bugs out the game and I don't really enjoy that. Frame limiter, I have my disabled so we can get all the frames that we can out of the game. Uh, Anti-aliasing we have that also disabled and high resolution assets texture asset textures uh, we don't have that ticked uh, high quality visual effects we have that on high and um, this uh, oh it says it in there that spawns more particle effects display this disabling increases performance I can't speak today I don't know why uh, I've just woke up as you can tell uh, but yeah so that you want to put that one on high um, it does look really weird in low but I recommend high just to get the best out of the game uh, bloom is up to you guys uh, obviously everything disabled increases performance but we've only ticked the ones that we want uh, to you know make it look that sharp but I do recommend having dynamic lighting on it looks pretty cool shadows my pet I hate shadows so we've got this off you can obviously set your shadow resolution to you know whatever you want uh, overlay resolution we have our set to 248 248 uh, 2048 sorry uh, and screen space overlay we have off now terrain we have low and i do recommend having this on low if you haven't got the best pc in the world uh, but if not have medium performance optimized so that we have you know you can play the game without getting a bit of lag high, resolu high resolution geometry i have that off but i have high resolution textures ticked on uh, high quality shader we have off uh, ambient occlusion you only can get that when you have high quality shaders so that's obviously off and high detail clutter we want that one off as well uh, going down to water now water is quite a, a big part of this game depends where you're on the map or it depends where you've uh, you know got your city and whatnot um, high resolution water I do recommend having off it does really dramatically uh, increase your frame so de definitely have that off and that off and reflections y you can have it on if you really want to one pass um it, it just means when you go over it and whatnot it, it shows you but i do recommend having it on disabled but if not just put it on one pass and if you want to be uh very very you know you know out there do two passes and then animated leaders you know what why is that even off like come on you, you want this on high you know you want to see them leaders you know what i'm saying let's confirm that but yeah you get the gist um these are the settings so if you want to pause the screen how far can we go up uh so these are the screens <laughs> uh if you guys want to pause the video copy them down test them out feel free to do so at the end of this video i'm going to leave a little benchmark uh so be sure to check that out to see how many frames i'm getting uh, and if that is all thank you all for watching hope you've enjoyed please leave a like and a comment on the video and i'll see you in the next settings videos and thank you for 2777 subs cheers